Hello, my dear lovely students. Let's discuss the summary of Supreme Court hearing on Renit today on 18 July 2024. So, first of all, we know that these Renit petitioner has asked or challenged this authenticity of IT Madras data analysis. So, as per the IT Madras data analysis, they indicate the normal distribution of marks. That means the bell curve, which is like happen in all the exams. This is the normal distribution seen in all the exam. So like average students getting 300 to 500 marks and toppers getting uh, like very less toppers are there who are getting 680 plus. And again, very less students are on this side means who are getting very less marks. So this is the bell shape, bell shape curve, right? Which is showing the normal distribution of the marks and showing that no spread, no widespread malpractices happened during this exam. So uh, then net need petitioner, this re-need petitioner were like, okay, data manipulation can be done over here because top rankers are from the same center which is the unusual pattern and it is hidden in the data itself right but again a supreme court accepted the data and they have given the uh, they have given some action uh, to the nta to do right so we will see what are those things that they have to do next re-registration and exam center so they were like we just want to know that how many students re-registered when you reopen the uh, nta uh, website for them for re-registration how many students have registered and how many students have changed their exam center during that time so approximately 15 20 000 students were there and out of those students 44 students getting the rank that means medical colleges they are getting selected in the government medical colleges getting the good rank this is the data by nta so then a uh, need petitioners were like, okay, so like why the cutoff is so high, significantly high this time? So NTA was like, okay, because overall syllabus was reduced in all the subjects and that was the reason that cutoff is really high this time. Next question was the Hazari bug. So we know that paper got leaked in the center at 8 a.m. Right, according to NTA, they have all the CCTV footage as they are saying. So it leaked, it got leaked at 8 a.m. and it was spread via the WhatsApp to the Patna Bihar also. And you know, from this center alone, 373 as 273 aspirants were there in uh, like were uh, there in the Hazari Bagh center. And out of those 80 students, uh, got this much under one lakh rank. That means they are getting the medical college right and then in Patna 1561 students are getting under 70,000 rank this time and NTA showed this data that you know it's matching the trend of the previous year so that means previous year also in 2023 also some like 1900 students were getting the 70,000 uh, under the 70,000 rank so that means trend is same so it is showing that matching the trend the trend of the previous year so that means no widespread leak happened no such event happened at the mass level and was confined to the local centers. Then Supreme Court asked NTA to present the report from the police station Patna. Right, so we know that they have the report of the paper leak in the Patna police station. They want to they want to know all the things about the like about the paper leak. Right, so that is reported there in the police station. Plus, they want NTA to publish the marks city and center wise like center wise uh, all the marks right of the students in the nta website plus they want to keep these students identities confidential but they want to see all these things right so that we get to know that from which center many students are getting the more marks next hearing will be on monday till 10 a.m so yes that means they are they they have still not decided what will uh, happen if renit happen if they are just you know conducting the re-exam or if they are like okay we are accepting the um, we are accepting the fact that you know the exam was fair and uh, you know the need will happen next year so nothing has been finalized so far so kids in case you have anything in your head anything you want to say please write down in the comment box and again i have told you every time that you study well if you really want to crack the need next year or if you feel that you are having the get you you are getting the less marks and you feel that you want to appear for the neat exam prepare for the next year or prepare you know start preparing nicely so if we need happen that's fine if it doesn't happen that's also fine if you are preparing uh, for the neat exam right so in case you have anything in your head please write down in the comment box have a great day